Hey everybody, welcome back. Tonight we're gonna do some smoked chicken thighs on the Rectech smoker. So let's get started. I just need to fill up the hopper oh, with some great B and B all natural post oak pellets. Filled it up. These are great pellets. I use these all the time. Let's get this closed up and get smoking. I'm gonna set this at 275. It's at 186 now. Just let it heat up a little bit more. While it's doing that, let's go ahead and get the chicken thighs all ready to go and the spice rub on. Eight chicken thighs. I right hear normal chicken thighs, skin on. I like to do, I just kind of get a paper towel and kind of dry them off a little bit. What I'm going to use tonight is some Salt Lake barbecue garlic dry rub. All right, let's get going. It's starting to rain now. I had a hurry. Always shake up the spice, make sure the salt's all distributed good. There's actually a lot of salt in it, so don't want to be too crazy with this one. I'm going to do the underside first. Now just flip them over, kind of pat them down, flip those over, do the same thing. All right, those are good to go. Put these on the smoke. All right, right when I was getting started, it decided to have a torrential downpour of rain. It only rains a few days a year, it seems like here in Austin, but tonight was one of them, and right when I got everything ready. So, like, smoker is all ready, got a big umbrella over it. It's fine, it'll be, be great. What I like to do too is I've got these seasoned. I have the dry rub on it. Some people cut the extra skin off. I like to keep it on there just to add flavor. I always just kind of tuck it under. And what I'm going to do is that I'm going to smoke these at 275 till the internal temperature gets about 160, 165. And then I'm going to crank the smoker up to high heat. And I'm going to put these skin side down on the grill grates. I have the grill grates set on the flat side. So I'll get the skin nice and crispy. Because a lot of times the chicken, when you put it on a smoker or pellet grill, sometimes the skin gets a little rubbery. So you really either need to cook it on higher heat or you need to finish it on high heat to crisp up the skin. So I always like to put a thermometer in, so I'm gonna find kind of the bigger pieces. This is a bigger one. I'm gonna stick this in, kind of right down through the middle. I'm gonna do that on a couple of them. Put these on the smoker. do about 275, 270, 275 degrees. Probably take about an hour. And then like I said, I'm gonna crank it up to high heat and I'm gonna stick them skin side down on the top of the grill grates. I have them on the flat side, so it'll kind of sear them nice and crispy. Finally stopped draining a little bit. The internal temperature just hit about 165. So I'm just gonna pop the chicken out. I'm gonna set them over here just for a second, crank the heat up, get the skin nice and crispy too. You can see Tico's excited. Pop this umbrella up, just keep the rain off me. I like to wear these gloves, it makes it super easy instead of using tongs. I'm just gonna take these off just for a few minutes. So I went ahead and cranked it up to high heat. I'm just gonna wrap these up in this foil just for five minutes or so until this cranks up super hot. And then I'm gonna throw them on the grill grates and get the skin nice and crispy. You agree, Tico? Sure thing. It's up on almost high heat. It's about 464 degrees right now. I'm gonna, it's been about been about 10 minutes, I think, since I took it off and heated it up high. I'm gonna throw it on here just for a minute or two, skin side down to crisp it up. It's super hot.
All right, I'm gonna just do that for a minute or so, then I'll flip them back for another minute and we'll be done. Hey, sorry if there's a little bit of water on the lens. I can't tell if it's on the screen or the lens. I'm gonna flip these over. Ooh, very smoky. Gotta be careful too when you have the lid open for a long time. The handles get hot. So make sure you have a glove on or a towel. They're fine when it's closed. When you leave it open, that hot air hits your hand. Let it go another minute and they'll be done. Oh, they're looking perfect. See how nice and crispy they are now? Looking great. Take these out. Go ahead and turn the heat off. Those. Again, if you don't have a set of these gloves, I highly recommend them. Without, you use tongs, and a lot of times when you use the tongs, you rip the skin off and stuff. Oh, these are looking great. Again, I put it on the grill grates, the flat side. Perfect for chicken. Look at those, those look gorgeous. Perfectly crisp skin, cooked to perfection. And I cooked them at 275 for about 45 minutes. Took them off for five or 10 minutes, cranked the heat up on the Rectech to about 500, 470, 500 degrees. Then I just put them one minute skin side down, one minute skin side up. That was it, they turned out great. If you like this video, please subscribe. Check me out on Instagram too at harpland underscore productions. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up.